Hi, I'm Kelly, a compassionate entrepreneur with Traits of Hope, and I just wanted to list some pros and cons of being a compassionate entrepreneur, uh, or really uh, things to think about when maybe you're considering the business opportunity. I, the first, when I first started, I was hesitant. I I really liked the purpose, I really liked the mission, and I really needed some extra money, but I just didn't think I would be able to sell anything. I thought I'd buy this kit, and yeah, sure, maybe I'd help a few women or you know, help move some inventory, but I didn't know if I'd really be able to sell anything. And my husband said, you know, just do whatever you want to do, whatever you feel like you need to do. And then I heard about our artisan group in Haiti, where these mothers are faced with the decision to have to give their children up in order for them to have a chance of survival. And I just couldn't imagine having to give my child up just so that she would be able to survive, uh, let alone being well cared for. And this artisan group that we partner with gives mothers like this the opportunity to have a job and to be able to care for their children, to be able to send their children to school and for their children to be able to break the cycle of poverty. And we partner with groups like this all over the world. And when you become a compassionate entrepreneur, you become a voice for these artisans. And that is pro number one. You get to partner with over 7,000 different men and women around the world and you get to be a voice for them and you get to join arms with other compassionate entrepreneurs and be and join this army of marketers to be a voice for these artisans to hear their stories to share their products uh, like this beautiful beloved necklace by um, young ladies in Guatemala and you get to hear their stories and share with, uh, with others uh, and you get to do this for all the low investment costs pro number two is it doesn't take much to get started uh, our smallest kit is $99 and after shipping and tax, you are in for way less than um, than a lot of companies and you have the ability to make it back within your first month easily. And I love helping ladies on my team be able to get their, their calendars full of bookings. And with just three parties in your first month, you can make back your investment plus profit. And I love working with my team to help them do that. And so you don't have very much of a startup with your kit. Pro number three is right away you get to see that commission. Every sale you make, you get your base commission. And then you have the chance to get bonus commission. And then, of course, if you build a team, you get commission off of their sales at the end of each month. And you can see that income immediately. And you know that when you're making those sales and that when you're making money, you're helping our artisans make money as well and to grow their businesses as well. Pro number four. So I at first, I wasn't sure that I would love host, having parties and working with hostesses and uh, getting out of the house to do that. I'm more of a homebody, but I, it has become one of my favorite things getting to do Trades of Hope parties and all the amazing women that I've met who have my hostesses and their wonderful friends who have become great customers. And I really love it. And I love hosting parties in my home. I actually just had a, a show with a friend who's a consultant for another company just this weekend. And it was so much fun to have my home full of my friends and to just be able to chat with them and it went all over the products and be able to help another friend in her small business. So you get to have fun and get out of the house and have an excuse to dress up and wear pretty accessories that are made with love and care by women around the world and you're making a difference in their life. Number five, um, you have the opportunity to build a team and to really, I love making meeting hostesses and making friends with hostesses and customers, but some of the best friendships that I've made have been with those hostesses and customers who have joined my team. And I love getting to know these women, uh, not just as business partners, but as friends. And so you have an amazing opportunity to grow a team and to be able to be a part of just this great family and sisterhood that we have at Trades of Hope, which is unlike any other community I've ever been a part of. 
which actually with this sisterhood and our founders and the home team and our wonderful trainer, you brings me to pro number six, which is we get wonderful training and all the tools you'll need to be successful in this business. As your uh, leader CE, manager CE on, the, on your team, I would love to help you find success in your business, whatever that looks like for you, and to lead you along the way to point you to the right tools and training to help you get a successful start and continue in a successful business, whatever that looks like for you, whether it's part-time, full-time, uh, on the weekends, one party a month, whatever that looks like for you. I love to help you find success in that. And we have, so pro number six is we have great training, and, which leads to great personal growth as well at, with business skills and just uh, personal growth. Uh, like I didn't feel comfortable at first doing parties and I had a really hard time just striking up conversations with the stranger in the store or in the park and now it's one of my favorite things to do. Even if the conversation doesn't lead to trades of hope, I just really enjoy meeting new people now, which is not something that I could say three years ago. And then pro number seven really kind of wraps back around to number one, but you get to be a part of empowering women out of poverty in a real tangible way, in a way that doesn't burn you out emotionally or drain you physically, although I can come home from a party pretty exhausted, but also really pumped because I just sold a lot of product made by women on the other side of the world who, without me and my sales team and this growing team of compassionate entrepreneurs, they wouldn't have the chance to be able to grow their business and to be able to employ more women in their community and to be able to see wells built and schools built and children educated and women brought out of sex trafficking and giving an actual, given an actual opportunity to not have to have a good dignified job and not have to go back to that lifestyle. And women who once maybe were working in sweatshops and in harsh and horrible conditions or women who had acid attack and who are seen as, who are looked upon with shame and um, unable to find work elsewhere, they're now able to have dignified work and to be able to provide for their families because I just had a party and had a lot of fun with some amazing women who bought their products and now I can provide for my family and they can provide for theirs. And so it's really wonderful to be able to make a significant change and a real difference in the lives of others without that burnout or exhaustion or without it breaking my bank. Uh, yeah, I had an initial investment. Yeah, I have some business costs here and there. But what I make each month more than covers any of that and allows me to be able to give back, to support missionaries around the world, and to be able to um, give back to women who are starting businesses and who or giving to programs that are feeding children and looking for ways to be able to help families stay together in their communities. So I love how it gives back without it costing me greatly because we can all do great volunteer work and we can all give to charity and those things definitely have their place and my family definitely uh, is involved in those things but this is something that I can do every day and know that it is sustaining my family and helping to sustain is sustainable and I know it's something that is sustainable for my family and that is sustainable for families around the world so those are my pros now the cons there are a few, you know, you own a small business and you have to keep up with your tax and maybe one month is really slow and so your numbers are a lot lower than other months. And maybe a few friends stop following you on Facebook or uh, don't call you as often. But really, <laughs> that's not a big issue. Or it hasn't been for me. Uh, the only con I can think of is well, this is the only thing that would have been a con to me, is if when I had joined, I hadn't done anything. If when I had just a few parties and I made back my investment and um, made those first that first thousand dollars in my first few months, uh, and I had stopped, then you know I'd stopped. My husband started working full time again. I'd stopped when we didn't really need the money anymore. Uh, 
then I wouldn't have grown in friendship. I wouldn't have grown personally and I wouldn't have grown a team of compassionate entrepreneurs and uh, marketers who are daily changing the lives of thousands of men and women and children all around the world, most of whom will never have the opportunity to meet, but some of whom I already have had the opportunity to meet. And really, that's the only comment I can think of is if I ever just decided to stop doing it. So you could join, you could buy your kit, you could not talk about it, you could not show off the pieces, you could not tell the stories, you could not see any personal growth, you could not see any, be a part of the change in our artisans' lives. You could just put your kit on the shelf and not do anything. And that would be a big con. But I don't know if you'd regret that more than you'd regret not joining. So give it a try. See if this is something that can fit into your life. See if this is something that can be a benefit to you and your family. And in the month of June, just for joining on top of whichever kit you pick, you'll also receive this lovely water lily wrap, which can be worn as a necklace like I'm wearing it now, or wrapped around your wrist. $44 value, um, just as a gift from Trades of Hope for those who join as compassionate entrepreneurs in the month of June. And if you do want to consider this amazing business opportunity and have any more questions, I would love to talk with you and help you make an informed decision and see what is best for you and your family.